Hello guys, in today's video, I'll show you how to fix the annoying error message. AMD software detected that a driver timeout has occurred on your system. If you've been running into this issue, don't worry. I'll walk you through a few simple steps that can help you fix it quickly. To start off, if you've overclocked your GPU, I strongly recommend underclocking it slightly, around 5 to 10%, and increasing the voltage by about 5 millivolts. These small adjustments can help stabilize the graphics card and often resolve the timeout problem. Once you've made these changes, use your system normally for a while and see if the error comes back. If that doesn't work, the next step is to check your AMD Adrenaline Edition software. Go ahead and open it, right click on your desktop and select AMD Software Adrenaline Edition in context menu. If you have the Instant Replay feature enabled, you'll find it under the Record and Stream section. Scroll down to the Media Settings and you should see the option for Instant Replay. Simply turning off Instant Replay has helped many users fix this issue. However, in some cases, like on my system, you might not see the Instant Replay option at all, and that's perfectly fine. There are still other effective solutions we can try. The first thing you should do is make sure your AMD graphics driver is up to date. You can easily check for updates through the AMD Adrenaline software. In my case, the software is already updated, so there are no updates available. But if you see an update, go ahead and install it. Keeping your graphics drivers current is crucial for stability and performance. Next, go ahead and click on the gaming tab inside the AMD software and then choose graphics. From there, set the graphics profile to custom. Scroll down until you find the reset shader cache option. Click on it and confirm by pressing OK. Once the shader cache is reset, try running your applications again. This simple step can often resolve the AMD software detected that a driver timeout has occurred error. If the issue still isn't fixed, let's move on to a more advanced solution. Open your web browser and search for display driver uninstaller DDU. Then open the first link guru3d.com website. Now scroll down and pick any available mirror link to download the tool and save the file to your computer. Once the download is complete, open the compressed archive and extract all the contents. Inside the extracted folder, double click on the display driver uninstaller setup file. When prompted, choose a location to extract the files. I'm extracting them to the desktop for easy access. Once the extraction is finished, open the folder and double click on display driver uninstaller to launch the DDU application. In the DDU interface, make sure the device type is set to GPU. It will automatically detect your AMD graphics card. Before using the clean and restart option, you'll need to boot your system into safe mode. To do this, right click in the, the start menu, select run, then type MS config and press enter. In the system configuration window, navigate to the boot tab, check the safe boot option and choose network. Click apply, then OK and restart your PC to enter safe mode. Now go back in safe mode, open DDU again, and this time click on clean and restart. This will completely remove all AMD GPU drivers from your system. After your PC restarts, open the run command again, type msconfig, and open the system configuration window, then again return to the boot tab. Uncheck the safe boot option, then apply and OK to bring your system back to normal mode. Now that your system is clean, go to the window settings, then click on Windows Update, check for updates or download and install. Windows will automatically detect your hardware and install the latest compatible GPU drivers, which should finally resolve the timeout error. And that's it for today's video. Hopefully, by following all the steps, you've resolved the AMD driver timeout error and your system is running smoothly again. If this video helped you out, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on future tech fixes and tutorials. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.